So hey you guys, I want to do a quick video for our event tonight just to talk a little bit one on one with you guys as to who I am and what I'm about. Most of you already know me because you're on my friends list and so we know each other personally but there might be a few of you who don't know a whole lot about me and I thank you for joining us for this tonight. Um, so as you know, um, since getting out of the military a couple years ago, I have been really, really challenged in... Uh, a lot of areas. Uh, areas of personal protection and security for my family, uh, finding a place for myself where I feel like I'm still contributing to um, society, contributing to the culture as I did when I was a soldier, uh, struggling with some of the challenges out here as far as uh, individuals. You know, now that we have the internet, a lot of things are easily accessible. I hear a lot more in the news and online about events and things happening um, and I've just been challenged and so what that drew me toward was what you hear about us uh, sharing on Facebook a lot and that's human trafficking and personal protection and family protection and that's what brings us here today you know I myself am a survivor I hate to say that word but that's what a common term of it, that's how people explain it but I myself am a survivor of sexual assault and um, I can't even tell you how many attempted sexual assaults or attempted harassment situations I've been in and over time I just got to a place where I felt like man that's just the norm if you're a female it's gonna happen if you're a male it's gonna happen and uh, it just became the norm but I'll tell you uh, the uh, this week when the hashtag me too came out it just refueled my desire to make sure everyone I know has an opportunity to be safe so that's what this is about that's simply why I'm here I hope during the time you're with us we have fun but I share some information with you so that you're able to make some educated decisions about you your tribe your tribe being your family your friends your co-workers your nieces and nephews your grandchildren that's your tribe and I want to help you make some educated decisions about about what helps your family stay safe whether it's day-to-day -day traveling in home or out and about you know I'm tired of hearing about things happening and feeling like man I could have helped them or I could have prevented that if I would have shown shared what God put in me you know my eight years in the military taught me a lot and being married to a soldier taught me a lot and so it's time that I start pouring out um, some of this information and I'm choosing to pour it out on you so this won't be a long video, but if you know anything about me, I'm long-winded. So that's why I'm not going to be live this whole entire time, and I'm only going to do a few videos. But we're going to go ahead and jump in. If you have your catalog, go ahead and get it out. We're going to start talking about some of the things that's in here. Um, we'll flip through, and I'll post different things. You can comment down below. Any questions you have, share it on that particular link and I'll answer them as we go. Uh, and I'm going to challenge you. I'm going to challenge you to rethink some things. There's, there's a few uh, posts that I have within this uh, group um, that's asking you some questions and we're going to chat about them so dive in make sure you have something to drink we'll keep it short and brief but at the end of this you'll have a new perspective on personal safety